You can enter the sewer from numerous entrances and go searching for mints, but the most direct route is through the door labeled Keep Out, just south of Lady Janeth's estate. There's a small room with a sliding stone panel which leads down to the sewer, taking you directly to Mince's group. Stopped me yet. All the coin seems to be there, if a little blood stained. You lot are enthusiastic about your lord's work. Our lady. We serve only the absolute. Oh, silly me. We Zen to him are so long past our own godly roots, I'm afraid I forget the half of them. But you, I know. When did you start worshipping gods? Did they give your wee rodent a worm friend, too? <coughs> Rodent. Enough! You will show the Stone Lord proper respect, and you will return to the Guild Hall and do as we have paid you to. Of course. I only thought... Wait. And suddenly, another presence looms in your mind. Another tap. Roa Moonglow. The traitor is carrying the pouch with the stolen gold. If Roa does manage to escape, you'll have to head back to Nine Fingers Keen's hideout to find her again. So the easiest way to get the gold is by killing her before she escapes. So it's better to attack instead of choosing to mask your presence. On that note, good luck. The job will be done by the time you get to the guild hall.
waste a step. These boots have seen everything. Can't give up. Not now. Let's do this. Take your heel.
does. Interest to this year. Best drama working in a bloody festival. I hope you've come to make a lodgment. A city sized one. And not even a whisker light. Gods, you're a boring bastard. This should be the part where I reward you, but looks like someone's nicked my key. Uh, consider this your one-time permission to crack the vault open. But if anyone asks, I never said it. Tell me about Minsk or Rattleman. <laughs> 